Hey guys, what's going on and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Mars Cosmetics Matte Lipstick Boxes. Now they have come out with four different boxes and each of them have about three lipsticks. So overall there are 12 shades and I have all the 12 shades with me. For foundation shade reference, I'm NC40 in MAC and in Maybelline, I'm 310 Sun Beige. Now, if you have not already, then do not forget to hit subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so notified whenever I upload. And now let's jump right in the video. Let's quickly go over with the features of these lipsticks. Now it says that it's a highly pigmented bullet lipstick that sets to a matte finish, has extremely creamy formula so it glides on like butter, it has one swipe pigmentation, every box is color coded and has three lipsticks of that color scheme. This product is 100% cruelty free and vegetarian as well. So like I mentioned before, they do offer about four boxes where there are three lipsticks in each of the boxes. So each of these are priced at 447 rupees and each lipstick weighs about 3 2 grams of product. So this is how one of the box looks like. Now this is a set number four which is brown. So at the top and the bottom you have the shade name and number. The lipsticks inside are color coordinated and at the back you have all the details such as ingredients, the weight, the manufacturing, the expiry and all the other details. And once you open it up this is how the lipstick set looks like. Now it is kind of color coordinated not exactly to the exact color but it is kind of close to it and it does come in this nice matte sort of a packaging with silver writing. At the bottom you have the shade name, number as well as the manufacturing and expiry and lastly this is how the actual lipstick looks like. And now let's finally move on to the lip swatches.
All right, so let's go over the formula, the pros and the cons. Now for the formula, firstly, these do apply very soft and buttery, very, very smooth. It glides like butter as it said in the feature and also this the way how it kind of glides it does remind me of their non-transfer butter stick where i have already done a review on it so yeah it is kind of similar to that and it is so soft and smooth like when you press your lips together it feels good now these are quite pigmented like the darker shades in one swipe you are good to go however for the lighter shades you may have to swipe like twice or thrice to get the full opacity these do take quite a while to set like it does take about three to four minutes for it to completely dry down to a matte finish like i have right now now until it sets it will transfer however once it has completely set to a matte finish it does transfer but very little for example You can see it has transferred very little on my hands now these are very light and comfortable on the lips like for example right now i have mixed in two different shades but even after all that layering it doesn't feel heavy it doesn't feel like a layer of lipstick is on my lips it feels very light it feels like there's nothing much or nothing at all on my lips now these lasted on me for about four to five hours and then i had to eat and this is how it looked like once i had a heavy meal now as you guys can see it does give that outer line sort of a thing however if i do press my lips together it gives me a sheer coverage of the original color however for the lighter or the nude shades it will completely go off and you will have to reapply them and lastly for the removal of these lipsticks it will easily come off by using a wet wipe oh and another pro that i almost forgot to mention i always keep forgetting some point or the other so these do not have that grainy or crusty feeling when you press your lips together after it has set so some of the mars lipsticks that i have reviewed in the past they have always been crumbly or grainy when you press your lips together after some time but these have not so that's a good thing now coming to fii there is just one quick point and that is the fact that these do have a smell to it now i personally don't mind it but it does smell a lot like the coffee toffee like i'll put a picture of what exactly i'm talking about i like that toffee by the way but yeah it does smell exactly like that however it is not strong or anything like only if you take the lipstick this close to your nose you can kind of smell it but then when you're applying it as well it's not that strong however if you are sensitive to any fragrances then i would suggest skipping this lipstick so yeah fii and now for the cons there are three points the first point is that there are no arm swatches available online i have said this con for so many different brands but yet again we are here there are no proper arm swatches available at all online for a consumer to buy so yeah that's the first con for me the second con is that one of the lipstick actually broke when i opened it for the first time during the swatch so yeah that happened and uh, some of the others there are two others which i kind of found it to be a little bit loose while applying it i did it upside down just to see if it's actually dropping or is it like broken it was not but i while applying it i could feel it dangling around if that makes sense so i know it is kind of loose so yeah that is the second con for me that one of them broke and the other two are kind of loose the actual lipstick itself so yeah and for the last con is like a personal opinion but then i really wish that the consumer could choose which three shades to buy off of all the 12 shades or the best would have been if they could be sold individually that would have been the best option ever the reason is because right now i have mixed two different shades which comes in two different boxes so just for the two shades you have to buy two boxes and each of them is priced at 447 rupees so yeah that is a con for me that i wish they were sold individually but again there's a personal opinion it's not like a huge deal breaker but yeah oh and uh, the last thing that i forgot to mention it is not a con but if you are planning to buy it make sure that you do research well because you can find them for cheaper so these do retail for like 447 rupees but then on amazon right now i saw it for like 318 or 319 rupees so uh, yeah research well because if you can find for cheaper why to pay full price for it so yeah so yeah guys these were my thoughts on the mars matte lipstick boxes and this wraps today's video you guys i hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget hit subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it notified whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or request i will try and visit for you as well as follow me on my socials which is on instagram and on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye